How did you get the Tech Waffle Floppy Uberman 7? I don't even have that yet. Well, hello there, Waffle Tears. Hope you guys are doing happy today. In the last video, a bunch of people were talking about the Staples decal on my super amazingly awesome calculator. Apparently, you can buy this coming soon product from Staples. I somehow did, and it was totally worth it. I mean, look at the big buttons. It's so cute! According to recent news, apparently McDonald's Happy Meals can last six months without rotting, molding, or even getting a case of these smell bads. A person by the name of Sally Davis bought a McDonald's Happy Time Happy Meal and left it on her coffee table, uncovered. She took pictures of it every day and after 180 days, the Happy Time Happy Meal looked untouched. Happy Time Happy Meal. I like that. It has doubly the happy. Now, if you've seen the video created by Morgan Spurlock, the person who created Super Size Me, this isn't really too shocking. He kept various burgers and fries in glass containers, and the Mickey D fries were unchanged after a long, long time. Mickey D, that sounds silly. How did Mickey D come from McDonald's anyways? It's like Puff Daddy and P Diddy. It doesn't really make sense. Anyways, the funny thing about this story isn't the fact that the Happy Time Happy Meals didn't rot, but the fact that McDonald's responded. Gasp! McDonald menu items are freshly prepared in our restaurants. You see, fresh is kind of a loose term. It could mean that they prepared it that day, that morning. Yeah, sure, that's fresh, but using not so fresh ingredients, if you know what I mean. McDonald's hamburger patties in the US are made with 100% USDA inspected beef. They are cooked and prepared with salt, pepper, and nothing else. No preservatives or fillers. Nothing else. I call bull dookie on that. Hamburger patties, they're usually made with other things like, you know, Breadcrumbs, eggs, Worcestershire Schwarzenegger sauce, and, and other stuff. So assuming that McDonald's has other ingredients in there such as eggs, breadcrumbs, Arnold Schwarzenegger sauce, why can't they have other preservative type ingredients in there? Like, I don't know, plastic! Plastic isn't necessarily a filler or preservative, plastic is plastic. Plastic makes bags and bottles which are apparently harmful to the environment. Remember to recycle, it's good for the environment. Then they go on and say how bacteria and mold only grow in certain environments, blah, 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 blah. And this got me thinking, how weird would it be to purposely leave food out there like that as an experiment? Not for you, but for other people. What if they throw it away? Or worse, what if they ate it? Good morning, Sitchies. Fury So 212 commented when the creepy chords played. I Where's my grapefruit? You ate my science? Not really. It turned it into jink. Want some? Okay, sure. Well, that's all I had to talk about today. If you want to learn more about the Happy Time Happy Meal stories, you can check out the links in the fla fla fla. I'll see you guys in the next video. Later! You ate my science? Not really. I turned it into great. Oh my goodness, so great. <laughs> <laughs> what, what, what are you gonna say? Just say you turn. I turn it into drink. Uh huh. Okay. Oh, so. I turned it into grapefruit. <laughs> that makes sense. Okay. You ate my science. No, really. I turned it into drink. Useless.